Hello friends, welcome back to our channel. In this video, let's see how to plant supernaphe grass for the dairy farms. Here, we will tell you how to cultivate, how to make furrows, how to plant the stems and how to irrigate them. Before that, let's see what is supernapier. Supernapier is a high yielding green fodder grass for dairy farms. They can give yield up to 250 tonne per acre in a year. First step in planting supernapier is cultivating the soil. This is a black soil and it requires ploughing and cross ploughing to be well broken. Hence, we are using heavy duty tractor with cultivator attached to it to prepare the soil. It will tilt the soil which has deep roots, unwanted plants, shrubs, weeds and is best for land preparation. Repeat this activity after one week so that new plants and weeds can be removed from the soil and the land will be 100% ready to plant super nepure. The next step is making furrows. Before making furrows, stretch out a rope across the plot and make sure you have a straight line. Now, let's make furrows at a gap of 2 feet width and 1 feet high. Here, we are using hand lapers to make furrows. You can also use furrow ridge tools attached to your tractor for toughest cultivation with outstanding penetration. Our next step is planting the stems. For one acre, we require at least 10,000 to 12,000 stems. We can use the how and a measuring stick to plant seedlings at a gap of 1 feet. Each stem should be 1 feet in length and should have 2 nodes. For planting, one node should be inside the soil and one node should go outside the soil. Please ensure the nodes are facing upwards, else the stem will not grow and it will die. After completing one row, you can complete planting the stems in the similar pattern in other rows also. Our next step is watering the plants. Watering should be done immediately after planting the supernapier stems. Watering should be done at least twice a week depending upon the type of the soil. Waste water from the cattle shed can also be used for irrigation as it is the best source of manure. Supernapier stems will start germinating within 7 to 10 days. And the weeds will also start growing in the form. These weeds will rob your plants of the benefits from the fertilizer that you applied and will start growing well. Means after 30 days, feeding has to be done for the plants. If required, a second spell of feeding can also be done after 45 days. After this, the supernapier grass will start growing well and it will become very dense. This supernapier will grow up to 12 feet. 90 days and will be ready for harvesting. Thanks for watching this video. See you again in the next video. Bye.